a local response rate. That's what you do in your hometown. <laughs> no, local really. I mean, re local response rates. It, think about a period of time. Let's say 10 minutes. You could capture a response rate across that whole thing. That is not a local response rate. The local response rate would be narrowing it down into a small slice of that time, right? So if you think of a 10 minute period and you have the response rate for that, the overall response rate, then you could break it down. Look at, well, what was the response rate at this little moment? It's very granular analysis, right? It's useful uh, because it allows you to see how that, uh, basically acceleration, allows you to see how things change, how that response rate changes over time, right? Uh, if you looked at schedules, the schedules of reinforcement book, you'll see that the patterns developed under certain schedules of reinforcement are not perfectly consistent. Some of them are scalloped, some of them are stepped. So the local response rate allows you to analyze each one of those individual pieces. So very useful for some things and not so useful for others. Local response rate.